Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, wherever you are in the world. So I hope you're all okay and taking care of yourselves and doing well. Let's see what the pagan cats have got for us today then. We have the Ten of Wands. There you go. He's a little bit burdened there, isn't he? All those sticks that he's carrying. Uh, what's he carrying them for? Looks like he's got a bit of a crutch there as well. Uh, yeah. So there's, um, there's a couple of ways of looking at this that um, I'm picking up there. One part is... Um, doing everything you can to to get by and to make ends meet and you know to get what you want out of life to live the life that you want and to look after yourself and your family you're doing everything that you need to do not afraid to put in the hard work and so like he's uh, carrying all those rods all in one go so he can get all that firewood into his home to heat the home up and that's what he's doing there so that's one way of looking at it and the other way of looking at it is that he's uh, carrying so many sticks to break his back, you know, carrying a rod for his own back and uh, he might be carrying too many at one time there. If he carries on going like that, it's going to make him ill, isn't it? Uh, if he carries on trying to do all of that in one go, it's going to make him very ill give him a bad back if not break his back as they say so it's telling you to also maybe just do things a little bit at a time even if you have to make several journeys sometimes it's a bit better to actually take a few rods at one time rather than making yourself ill you know sometimes we can go over the top and um you know, if we if we do it once or twice, then it probably will be okay. It probably wouldn't hurt, would it? But when we're doing it constantly, we can actually be, it can be real detrimental to ourselves. And then if we're not looking after ourselves, how can we look after other people? How can we look after our family if we're ill and if we've made ourselves ill? It, we can't do it, can we? So sometimes you need to sit back and just take it easy. Just do things one step at a time. Just do a little bit at a time to get what you want out of life because then things will actually, it, it might take a little bit longer. But as, what's the point of going all out to do it quickly and making yourself ill? Because if you make yourself ill, then you're not going to enjoy what you've achieved, are you? But if you take a little bit longer, then when it happens you can enjoy your achievement and you can really start to congratulate yourself on, on achieving the goals that you've set for yourself. All right. So although you're not afraid of the hard work, sometimes that hard work may not be necessary to get to where you want. It could actually be that you need to take a little bit, a smaller step, and I always say to people, you know, you can set your, your long-term goal, but try and break it down to smaller steps. Like a ladder, when you've got a ladder, you've got all these rungs on the ladder, and each of those rungs is a smaller step. But when you take it one rung at a time, then you soon get to the top. But you, you can't just, you know, run and jump and get to the top because you're likely to slip and fall and then hurt yourself. And then what's the point of that? <laughs> you know, if you take it one step at a time, you're more likely to get to the top in one piece. And once you get to the top, then you can look down and say, oh, wow, I've, I've climbed all this ladder and I can now, you know, congratulate myself and enjoy what I've just achieved. Okay. But let me know what you think as well in the comments section below. And remember to click like and subscribe and then I will catch you next time. Take care. Bye.